we are David Bowie, and we're going to do some improv here for you. Uh, and uh, first off, we need a location, and Sam procured some locations from uh, the uh, Facebook forum, Baltimore Improv Community. Did we just want to uh, pick one of those, a uh, first one, or what are I we doing? It's only, we, we got a, a number of uh, suggestions. I think it's only fair that we choose the first one. Um, um, suggested by the one and only Kristen McKenzie. Awesome. Wow. I'm, I'm happy to say she, she suggested Hall of Mirrors. <laughs> So, uh, mirrors. <laughs> so take that as you will. Um, David Bowie presents Hall of Mirrors. Hall of Mirrors. Hall Hall of mirrors. mirrors. <laughs> All right. <laughs> I am nervous, 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 because this is a big day. Like, I have been working at this carnival forever, but uh, <laughs> I'm not working at the funnel cake stand anymore. I'm finally working at the fun house. And uh, <laughs> that hall of mirrors is like, blows your mind, right? It just, you know, like, you don't know which way. I don't know. I just, they tell me not to get too wrapped up in my job, that I'm not allowed to go through the maze with the uh with the guests but you know like if they get stuck i'm there i'm your guy i'm definitely your guy oh i'm so sorry i was so excited about my promotion mm -hmm. uh my name is my name is bert and uh i'm i'm <laughs> i'm in charge of keeping those windows real clean <laughs> hello i am philippe I'm from Belgium. Uh, I produce halls of mirrors. I, um, I design mirrors and um, from time to time I'm called upon to uh, come incognito to, uh, to festivals to uh, pretend that I am a visitor, to pretend I know nothing of mirrors and to enter into the mirrors and look around and see the regular guests and uh, unbeknownst to them, I'm thinking about their experience in the mirrors that I have created. I am talking to them and I am pretending to experience the mirrors as if it is my first time, but it's <laughs> not my first time. I'm, I'm just here with the, to, to see their experience and to learn from it. My name is Severus. I frequent the House of Mirrors. One might say that I work at the House of Mirrors. I just always really appreciated um, the reflection that a mirror can give. I hope that nobody comes this year so that I can experience the House of Mirrors on my own. We'll see. Uh, yeah, so my family has been running what we used to traditionally call the freak show uh, at the carnivals for uh, generations now, three generations, Chopin, Chopin family freak show. Uh, you know, unfortunately that's no longer politically correct, so it was renamed the show pay family hold interesting people, you know, and, and we do like, you know, it, it's a more tame, tame version of, uh, of the freak show. So, so, uh, you know, it, it doesn't always get the people coming in like it used to. And I'm sick of all these new attractions, them the hall of mirrors or, or, you know, the various rides and the various, Oh, Hey, look, play this game. Oh, look, you can do play Pokemon Go when you're with your phone now or whatever. It's like, nobody likes the old fashioned hall of interesting people. Nobody, people come up to me, the carnival operator comes up to me and says, David, you know, I'm not sure we can keep this here any longer. And I think, I think that would be a real tragedy to see one of the last vestiges of great carnival living go out the door. And I'm determined to make sure that doesn't happen. <laughs> I own the carnival, but 
you know, the carnival is really just a front for my other business operations. And, um, you know, so I, I get around to all the different events and special shows that we have here at the carnival. I conduct my business. I meet with the people I meet with and everyone, you know, likes to call me boss which I like because I'm a boss in a lot of different ways, if you know what I'm saying. Hey, let's cut to boss and Bert in the, in the opening, in the first room of the Hall of Mirrors. I got it shined up really good for you. <laughs> I've been cleaning all morning. I like the work you're doing around here, Bert. You know, you're rising up in the world of the carnival. I know. I am I am thrilled to not be near the deep fryer as much as I was at the funnel cake stand. I appreciate you looking out for me. Thanks. I'm I'm grooming you, Bert. I just uh, you know, I see you as a real mover and a shaker. You got a special quality. Okay. <laughs> Thanks. <laughs> you noticed you like the way I clean the mirrors. <laughs> I like the way you clean things up. That's right. You know, I, I, I yeah. like to, uh, I could make use of somebody with your skills in a lot of different ways. I'm just saying, you know, do we, uh, do we have another attraction with, with glass or mirrors? Cause that is what I'm really good at. Like, look at it. There's no streaks. Yeah. You don't leave anything behind and no. you know what, you know, I, I don't know if you're squeamish at all. If you take like, oh. uh, jobs that are real, real dirty. Oh, no problem at all, boss. I mean, you should have seen some of these mirrors. I'm pretty certain that a kid threw up on one of them. That's gross. <laughs> yeah, getting rid of bodily fluids. That's what I'm talking about, Bert. You I'm know, your, but guy. you know, what kind, what kind of boss am I if I don't ask about your family? How is your family doing, Bert? Oh, my goodness. Uh, you know, if, uh, if my mom was still living, she'd be so proud of me. Uh, as it turns out, I guess technically at this point, I'm an orphan. So I got nobody. This, this, uh, carnival is kind of my, uh, kind of my family. Can I, yeah, it is like, it's, you're kind of like my, my, my father figure. Uh, I wouldn't go so far as to call you dad, but you know, no. boss. Yeah. I think for now you're going to call me boss, but you know, okay. um, I think that's perfectly appropriate, you know, but okay. I, I would I'm just wondering, you know, about, so you don't have any family. No, um, just me. <laughs> and, and you don't have any bad habits or anything like that, right? No, no. I, 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 I stick by the rules and, you know, I do as I'm told and uh, I don't ask questions, you know, all the right things. <laughs> Boss. All the right things. That's yeah. right. I like it. I like yeah. it a lot. Well, oh, uh, you know, I, I'd like to meet you in one of the back hall rooms of the Hall of Mirrors later on. I have some people I want you to meet. Oh, okay. I was told that I wasn't allowed to go in there when there were guests there, but I mean, you're the boss. So that means that that overrides everything else I was told, right? Yeah, I'm the boss. That's right. That's okay. Right. I, I, I to Dave and Philippe, Philippe in the break room. Hmm. Stupid. Well, uh, Dave, it's been a, it's been a very long, uh, a very long trip, but uh, I'm back here in, uh, back here in Altoona, Altoona, Pennsylvania. I've come back to see you and I've come back to see how my mirrors affect people. Yeah, they're stupid. They're stupid. I don't they're like it. They are stupid, Felipe. We talked. Look, I can't sugarcoat this. They're taking my business away. They're killing me. This is good, clean family business. Generations. Come on, man. Maybe, uh, you know, make it a little more. It's it's spectacular. It's spectacular. But that's, what's, that, that's what worries me, okay? It's too good. Felipe. Yes, but Dave. Yes. Dave, the most important thing is our relationship. 
and the the deep moments of affection of our bodies and of our that we felt together, the closeness that we felt over these years. When when I take that airplane from Belgium and I come and I know I'm going to be so close to you. I know when I when I think about when I think about being close to you, Dave. I don't think about the uh, old time old time uh, carnival show, the new halls of mirrors. It all disappears in our romantic embrace. Back when we were in carnival school together. Yeah. We both were two young kids looking to make it work, you know? Me from Belgium, you from, from Parkville. Yeah. We had to do things on different sides of the Atlantic. Yeah. And we just... And here we are together in Altoona, Pennsylvania, and... I'm burning with desire for you, but I'm I'm also burning with desire to see how people how people are going to experience my mirrors, and I don't want that to destroy the, what you've created. No, I, I I know I understand you love mirrors. Mirrors. I mean, back in carnival school, you you were valedictorian of the mirror section of of the class. You know, <laughs> you killed it. You killed it. Just the, 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 your your final essay about about you know medium-sized mirrors versus large-sized mirrors was just brilliant and i respect that but the I'm way you're talking just... dave 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 you know that these things can't happen in the break room we can't get it on in the break room it's just anybody can come in and it's not appropriate but you're tempting me with the way you're talking i'm talking about my old essays well, I'm glad you're tempted. I'm glad you're at least feeling that way about me still. And maybe that, maybe that feeling you have towards me can rival that which you feel from mirrors. Okay, that's, that's honestly why I felt the need to go to the other side of the world from you. Cut it, to okay. Severus and Bert at the cotton candy stand. Hi there. <laughs> I'm Bert. I clean the mirrors. <laughs> They're very clean. Have you been in yet? Yes. <laughs> ah, <laughs> you're not real chatty. That's all right. I can make up the, the talking for us. Uh, you know, I was thinking about getting some uh, cotton candy on my break. Do you like blue or pink? All right, I think we're going to go with blue. <laughs> All right. So, uh, I think I've seen you in the Hall of Mirrors before a couple of times. What do you think of my work? Clean. There is a tall mirror in the back. Mm -hmm. It has a crack in it. Huh. Are you talking about like at the very back? Mm, You're yes. a really observant kind of person. I like that. So uh, I will definitely put that on my to-do list. We're gonna need a new mirror because we can't have a crack in there. It just ruins the illusion. Am I right? <laughs> mm. <laughs> I love the reflections in the mirrors. Up. Oh. You're welcome. I get them shined out really well. <laughs> I'm burp, by the way. Uh, I mean, don't kind of throw this around, but throw it around if you want to. Like, I'm practically the boss's son. Practically the boss's son. <laughs> That's how I can take a break on my shift. Nobody else gets breaks. He says I got to meet him in the back. Maybe I'll check out that mirror crack then. Yes, please do. Please do. It changes the reflections. Okay. You're yes. like real, real serious about your uh, mirrorology, huh? I, I come to this every year um, and I spend all my time in the mirrors, the hall of mirrors. It's truly a surreal experience. Well, I'm, I'm just happy to be a part of that experience, keeping it clean. You know, it, you would not believe the amount of Windex that I go through. Kind of why I picked the blue, because I'm looking at blue all day, all day. Cleaning the mirror. That's what I'm doing right now. 
You're not clean. You're not clean. There is no mirror. I know. I was just saying, like, that's what my, I like in my sleep, my arm does this. <laughs> just cleaning the mirror side to side. No streaks. No streaks. Is that something, is that something you think that you'll be doing for the rest of your life? <laughs> I sure hope so. I mean, this is a really great job. Boss likes me. He was asking me all kinds of important questions, you know, and I, I feel like I'm going to, I'm going to be useful. He said that. <laughs> it cut to uh, Boss and, and uh, Felipe uh, behind the back trailer of the carnival. Here you go, here, here. Felipe, you know how to make an old man happy. <laughs> we have techniques in Belgium. Mm. But, uh, so, something about the window cleaner. I feel like, uh, I don't know, they heard the, this new window cleaner it looks an awful lot like you, boss. Well, you know what? The fact yeah. of the matter is, is I'm grooming Bert. I'm grooming Bert to take over all this when I'm gone and more. But he doesn't know it, but he's my natural born son. <laughs> natural born son. But when you were visiting Belgium with my sister, wait, my sister had that had that child that was stolen from the hospital. Yes. Burr is, in effect, your nephew. Ah. And he cleans mirrors. And he cleans mirrors, you know? It's like, it, how perfect is that, given what you do for a living, which not a lot of people know about, but I do, because I'm the boss. <laughs> exactly. You hire me to make the mirrors, right? You wanted, you wanted my touch on those mirrors. <sighs> wow. That's right. It's all you coming together. You my touch and now my own, my own flesh of my sister and my, and my <laughs> client is cleaning what I produce. It's beautiful. Yeah. It's really beautiful, you know. Um, in a way, it's, it's a like... It's, it's a circle of life, boss. It's a circle it, of it, life. <sighs> we cut to Severus and Dave uh, in front of the uh, not oddities. <laughs> not freaks. It's a hall of interesting people, so you see. So, uh, so it's like, um, you know, we can't do anything offensive, but there's like a really tall guy in there. Uh, and there's like a lady who can um, like long jump for like a very long distance, like not Olympic, but, you know, pretty long. It's, it's crazy. You really should pay your money to get in there. I mean, you know, it, it's better than the Hall of Mirrors, if I do say so myself. Sir, there's nothing better than the Hall of Mirrors. And I don't, I don't want to see your, your people show. I don't think that it's appropriate to showcase people in that respect. No, but see, see the carnival really put it, put it like, brought me in to say heel, so to speak. So I have to just showcase positive things, like people doing interesting things and stuff like that. You know, like there's a guy that can shuffle like six decks of cards at one time. I mean, that's crazy. <laughs> you got to say that's crazy, you know? You <laughs> like, yeah, it's better than a mirror. I do say it's better than a mirror, wouldn't you say? I, I, excuse me to, to butt in, but I, I, I kind of agree with this, with this, uh, this, young, uh, this young student here, Severus. Um, I, uh, I think that the, uh, the mirrors is really, uh, would be an interest. It would be interesting to see what we experience there. Hmm. 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 
Well, mirrors aren't everything, okay? Maybe I appear to think that the human condition is more interesting than a reflection of the human condition. You're seeing real life and not just fakeness, you know, not just an imitation thereof for all intents and purposes. The mirror, the mirror is the reflection of reality. No, no, young, young students, you would certainly agree, right? That the reflection of reality is something we all crave. Yeah, but I would say, uh, my associate here, you would, you would agree that, that, that seeing something new would probably be a cool thing also rather than the old kind of tried and true mirror thing, right? Cut to a meeting about Dave with everyone except Dave. <laughs> I think you know why I've gathered you all here today. Hey, Bob. <laughs> yeah. Um, oh, I hate Severus. You know, I, 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 we're, we're just regular guests here. I'm not any different than you, Severus. I'm... I'm just another guest here at the park, and the the boss has called me in. <laughs> uh, I'm I'm pretty sure I saw you uh, reviewing the mirrors, and you were taking notes. Yeah, I'm pretty certain I saw that. I did, right, boss? Yeah. Or I didn't? What What do I say here? The gig's up, Philippe. Yeah, you know <laughs> the gig's up, and it's all right because I'm just a real worried about Dave and his stance against the Hall of Mirrors, and I. You know, I don't want to jeopardize his Bert's future or Severus's obsession. Gig, no, no, the gigs. So you told you told Severus that I'm I'm just not a regular carnival goer. Severus is an observer of human nature, and I think already has caught on to your gig. So, uh, what do you what are you going to need from us? You, I don't want to lose my job, boss. It's a great job. I love working for you. I mean, like I could do it in my sleep. I'm going to need you to take care of the problem, Bert. Wait. Okay. Okay. Wait, wait, the, the, hold on. wait, wait, wait. I'm your it guy. Sounds like no, it sounds like the problem is a certain individual. Yeah, I'm on it. Okay. Then you better, you better take care of that individual quickly. I'm going to, I'm going to make sure that, that they are very weak and vulnerable to, to what's going to happen. Yes, yes, yes. Okay. Sounds All right, good. boss. It sounds like he's going to help out, and I'm going to clean up. Get it? Got it. <laughs> <laughs> we cut to Dave and Philippe. <laughs> I know no, that now. Not, no, 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 not now, Dave. It's not right. time for that. Okay, it's not time for that. There's serious stuff going on. Um, what's what's up? You can tell me anything. You know that. You you need to be safe. Okay, I um to be safe. I think that the best place for you is to really enter the Hall of Mirrors. There'll be many copies of you. Just let's let's go in the Hall of Mirrors together, okay? Let's go in now, okay? Here we go. Here whoa, we go. whoa, 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 whoa. That, that goes against... Oh. Just come come into the Hall of Mirrors. I'll trust you. People. All right, I'll Those trust people. you. Okay. All right, I'm Those trusting people you. are going to... Here we are. We're in the mirrors now, okay? And those I don't people... like this, but I trust them. Oh, oh, Hi, hi, look, look, there's so, you know, another another client who, yes, another fair goer um, who, who knows about my backstory to, to, to some extent, to, to some extent. Um, and here we are in the Hall of Mirrors and, and Dave, there's so many copies of you. Who knows where the real Dave is? Right? It's impossible to know. And I feel so safe with so many copies of my beloved. <coughs> Well, since I don't know which one is the real Severus, uh, I'm just going to say this now. <laughs> you always seem like so weird. You creeped me out, you know? You just seem like really weird and stuff, you know? Like, oh. odd. I'm it looking for a like Dave. Me. It's so disorienting. Is there a Have Dave? Is a there Dave? a Severus? Is, Dave? What is there? Oh. What is there? Oh. That was so clean. I knocked myself out. I'm coming, Dave. Can you call out Marco? 
What? Well, oh, it's it's no, it's it's a nice guy who cleans the mirrors. Okay. Oh, uh, 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 Dave, Dave, um, look at, uh, uh, I don't know, look at my abs. Okay. Oh, nice. Don't, Do you call, out, don't call out Marco. Just look at my abs. Did you say Marco? Say, okay. Hold my on. My abs are further down. These are my pecs. Or right, whatever. Don't say okay. Marco. Just look Am at I my pecs. Am I supposed to say fire. Marco? Hold on. Oh, Pecs, pecs, pecs. I'm, I'm, I'm looking at them. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. You used to, you used to fondle them with great. Um, I did. Great yeah. Things. Yeah. It was after carnival school. We would slip out to the, to the dorm room and. I think I've uh, nearly got you, Mr. Dave. I think I'm. In the, oh, <laughs> that's another mirror. Uh, look, uh, Dave, 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 you're in great danger. It's not. I don't oh, know how to say it. From Severus. <laughs> No, not from Severus. I don't know what to say about Severus. Severus is still a deep mystery, but at least that mystery is not the danger that you're in. I would almost say run towards Severus because Severus is not the what? danger. Just run towards Severus, okay? Please run towards Severus and, and don't avoid everything else, okay? All right, Mr. Dave. I'm certain I found the right one this time. Oh, another mirror. Oh, God. Okay. Okay. Oh, shit. Severus, come back! No, you need. Oh, for Christ's sakes! I don't know how to get out of this place. Why did I let him talk me? Oh, okay, I'm sorry. I said the thing about you being a weirdo before. You know this place better than anyone. Help me get out of here. I promise we'll be best friends. You can come to my hall of interesting people. I'll give you like fifty percent discount. Uh. I think there's a lot we have in common, you and I, really. I mean, I think we're both kind of, you know, marked to the beat of our own drummer, you know? Sir, so. I think that your statement about me being weird is more of a reflection of yourself. I was just joshing, <laughs> you know? I was just, oh, come on. Can you just oh. call out Marco one more time? I think Why do you want me to say Marco? Polo, hi. All right, boss told me that I needed to find you and I needed to clean things up. Uh, stand still. I'm gonna get you with this Windex. What? What Hold on, heck? I'm gonna get it cleaned off in a jiff. No, no, no. All right, you know, guys, I cleaned them good. You know what? Let's just let bygones be bygones. You know, uh, I've been thinking, I, while you guys were all over here at the House of Mirrors, I went and checked out the Hall of Interesting People. And you know what I found? What did you find? It was pretty interesting. You no. Know? It was. And I think these two attractions can coexist. So I get to keep my oh. job? Oh yes, yeah, son. I'm Wait. happy with that. Did you just call me son, boss? That's right. That's, That's our right. show. <laughs> <laughs>